So in this question, you have to draw a regular pentagon of 50 mm sides using any method. So first of all, we will try to draw it using special method. The first step is to draw a horizontal line of the given dimension that is 50 mm in our question. Now you have to take radius equals to 50 mm in your compass, keeping the end of the line as the center, draw a circle. Then using the same radius and shifting the compass to the other end of the line as center, draw another circle. Now you have to use the intersection point of these two circles given below and you have to draw another semicircle or more than half a circle which is touching both the circles at two different locations. Now you have to join these two points using a vertical line. Using this point and the intersection of vertical line and the more than half circle, you have to join it and extend it until it touches the another circle. Similarly, you have to join this point with the point of intersection, extending it until it meets the circle. Now you have to join the end of the line with this point. This is our second side of the pentagon. And similarly on this side, you will get the third side of the pentagon. Now taking compass again, with the same radius 50 mm, draw two intersecting arcs using the new points. And by joining these two points, we can complete our pentagon. Let's give the dimension. This is the dimension line. Drawing the arrowheads. Dimension should be always above the line. This is 50 mm. Let us label this pentagon as PQRST. Let us draw the pentagon by another method that is our general method for any polygon. The first step is to draw a horizontal line of given length that is 50 mm in our case. Then you have to draw a perpendicular line to this line of the same dimension that is 50 mm. Once you have drawn these two lines, you have to take a compass and draw the arc joining both ends. Now the same two ends should be joined using a straight line in this manner. Now you have to bisect this horizontal line using more than half distance in your compass. So we are drawing a line bisector here. After drawing this line bisector, the points where this bisector meets the straight line and the arc, that distance you have to bisect it again. So this vertical bisector is going to be bisected in this manner. So this is the bisector and this is the point which is to be used as center for our pentagon. So using this as the center and radius equal to any point of this horizontal line, both distance will be same. You can draw a circle here. The circle should be faint because it is the part of the construction and not the actual diagram. Using this horizontal length as 50 mm in your compass, 
start cutting the arcs on this drawn circle joining these all sides we can complete the pentagon and the last thing is to give the labels i'm using the same labels here you can use any of this one method there are more methods also apart from these two you can use any method because in the question it is not mentioned any method specifically so this is the dimension line using the arrowheads to indicate it and the dimension of the line should always be above it this completes the solution